Welcome to the Kids Cooking Show. Today we are making sandwich rolls. Today Roll we are us. making sandwich roll. -up. Sandwich roll-ups are more inviting than just a regular sandwich. So it's perfect for picnic party or as a starter or appetizer, any occasion. So let's start making sandwich roll-ups. First step is to prepare bread slices. Take the kitchen scissor and trim the brown part of the bread slices. This job can be done well by six plus years. The second step is to roll the bread slice and preschooler can do the, that job. We have some bread slices ready. You can use wheat or white bread. So now it's a fun part. Mm -hmm. You can use many ingredients to prepare this roll-ups. The first thing is cheese slices. You can use some peanut butter and jelly. You can apply some mustard and cheese together tastes so great or you can make some pesto you can make some pesto coriander pesto or a basil pesto <laughs> and apply that and some other vegetables and stuff so there are a lot of variation for um. this roll-ups the first one I'm going to simply prepare with just a jam strawberry jam here I have and you can make the uh, peanut butter jelly sandwich so you can apply some peanut butter and then some jelly no. Mm, I like it. This could be your dessert even, you know, simply just they could jam roll-ups. They could hear that. <laughs> so now roll tightly and this jam will help us to stick the ends even nicely. So this is how we can prepare the roll. It looks very yummy. My mm. turn! My turn! It's both of our turns. These roll-ups are perfect for kids and even grown-ups. So use the ingredients that grown-ups like, such as, as I said, pesto or some vegetables. Of course, cheese, everyone likes it. So you can uh, come up with your own idea here. Now Drew is going to make cheese roll-ups. So first apply some mustard. Here, Drew. Okay, thank you. Just squeeze a little bit all over the bread. Then you can just spread with the knife. Yummy already. Next thing is a slice okay. of a cheese. And now roll again. You can roll either way. You can roll this way or oh, this can. way. Oh, wait, okay, Drew roll is it. going to roll. Roll tight. I'm rolling tightly. Yeah, you have to roll the ends tightly as well because. So you have to actually hold on can the end the and the middle mm -hmm. and then roll like that so in this one the mustard helps to stick the ends the uh, third one is is here I have this coriander and uh, mint chutney you can make pesto one slice of a cheese and here I have some shredded carrot I'm going to put on one end actually I'm going to roll the other way so I'm gonna put up here And same thing, just roll tightly. Mm. So this is ready. So we are done making <laughs> some rolls over here. Now, if desired, this can be toasted in a toaster oven or in regular oven. So it's really up to you, but you can even serve as it is. And you can cut them into about two to three inches wide and they look so beautiful, awesome. So here are the rolls ready. They look so beautiful now you can see that because you can see the uh, The spread that you did inside and it looks colorful and nice and now it's time to give it a bite So who is ready? I am. Which I one am. is yours? This one. This one. Okay Sushi time. I'm going to bite. And yours is cheese. Only cheese. I need a plate. Here we go. It, it makes your mouth water. Yes. Good? Yummy, nice. 
So this was all about sandwich roll-ups. Thank you for watching and we will see you soon with the next great episode of Cooking with Drew or Kids. Don't forget to like and subscribe.